All right, in this one we're going to look at adding a musical intro and outro. They help to make sound files a little bit interesting, generate interest at the start. Okay. So here I've got a file loaded in Audacity when I play it. In this project, we are going to learn to edit. Just a little bit of a voice, and what I want is an intro that's going to fade out as the voice starts. So you need to find a little bit of music that you want. You can cut it out of a um, music that you own or have the rights to use. You can create it yourself. Um, whatever you use, you need to know where it is stored. So I'm going to import it. So you go down to File, Import, Import Audio. And I happen to have a um, beat called Old School Break, which is in the audio folder right? Um, at school. So I'm going to click on that and just go um, open. And you'll see that it opens into a new track. So now when I play it, you'll hear the um, break is rather loud in comparison to the, um, the spoken audio. <laughs> very loud indeed. I can, I've got individual track volumes that I can turn down here um, and what I'm going to need to do now so I can I can use those to adjust between the two um, audio between the two tracks but what I need to do now is move pick up the move tool and move the vocals until they just slightly overlap the audio. Um, the problem is now to fade this out as the vocal starts. Now to do the fade out we're going to use the envelope tool. So you hover over there and you'll see envelope. I need to click where um, I want the fade out to start and click where it fades to end. Now I'm clicking and holding and pinching in by dragging down the mouse while clicking and holding. Um, I drag the audio there and you'll see when we play it that it fades out. I can adjust that as well there. So now when I fade Sorry, now when I play I should get a nice fade out um, of the music and the audio starting. In this project we are going to learn to edit. Right, so um, the outro is exactly the same. I could um, copy and paste the outro first and go down to the other end and of course put the envelope the other way. And that's all there is to it. So use the envelope tool and um, make sure you've got the music saved somewhere where you can find it. Alright, good luck with that. Look forward to hearing your stuff.